We're here back at the Scotiabank Centre in Halifax at the Ford World Men's Curling Championships. I'm here with the skip of Team Italy. Tell me a little bit about your week so far and how has Halifax been? Oh, simple to say. Good start, bad uh, ending. I mean, it's not, end, it's not over yet, but we struggled very much in the last five games. We played uh, bad. The other teams played much better than we did. And we lost four games in a row and now the fifth tonight. So feels bad. I mean, we had a great beginning, two wins out of two, but uh, we just, we, we couldn't keep it, keep it going. Uh, but what can I say? We try to do the better next game, next games. Halifax has been great so far, weather so-so, but nice city, happy to be in Canada. Describe the feeling of being in Canada and being able to play in a venue like this uh, with, with so many seats and so many fans around, the big crowds, that must make it exciting for you, does it? It does, yes. Playing curling in Canada, it's always very exciting. Uh, you get to play in front of a bunch of people who know what curling is, you know, and so they, they, they cheer at the right time, they uh, applause at the, right, uh, the right time for good shots. Yeah. Um, good cheering for Team Canada, but I would say uh, nice people and it's always good to, to play in front of them. Halifax is known to be the pizza capital of Canada. As a true Italian, can you tell me what your thoughts are on their pizza, if you've had any yet? We had pizza. We tried a few places already. We are still uh, judging which one is the best and we'll let you know by the end of the week. Now one more question. Have you ventured into the Donaire yet? Not yet. Not yet. Uh, we will try to do that also. That's great. Thank you very much for your time, Joel. Good luck the rest of the week. Thank you very much. Thanks for checking this video out. For more great videos from the 2015 Ford World Men's Curling Championships, check out curlingzone.com. I'm Robbie Doherty.